episode four, the forgotten turnabout. A little bit. L little bit what? Nothing, I'm talking to Amy. Okay. She's gone now. Hello! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who's talking, so I guess I'll just Aptitude go for it. Aptitude and ability as a prosecutor. You're on trial for sucking. <gasps> Listen. the principal's office. Who are you? Hey. Oh, why are you wearing that raincoat? Ghost trick clock. <laughs> no wonder people like this game. Kay finally dies. <sighs> you hear Kay well, died? <laughs> gumshoe powering down. No, no. I'm out of gumshoe batteries. Oh, good. It was just a test. Here oh. he goes again. Calm down. You're getting dust everywhere. You go. Oh yeah. So uh, Marissa's not privy to a lot of our dumb gags. So uh, you mean the lore? The lore. As of so as of the second game, we've decided Miles Edgeworth is a robot. Uh, good. And Gumshoe is some form of golem who Edgeworth has taken under his wing. What? <laughs> Because all of his sprites have this, like, giant, loose jaw flap. <laughs> <laughs> Calm down, you're getting dust everywhere. <laughs> See, look at it. I've already what? cleaned this room three times since this morning. Oh, well, gonna, now you'll need to do it a fourth time. Oh, yeah, that's I, right. Will and I have both been gumshoe in the past. Yeah. Oh. Um. Yeah. Savvy. Fight, fight, fight. I think Savvy should take this. Okay. okay. Yeah, you sure? All yeah. Right. You're always too calm, sir. What if they actually take your badge? Hang on, I gotta balance some of you on my end. Savvy's a little quiet. Will's a little... Everyone's a little quiet. Maybe my Discord is fuckled. Because I was editing shit the other day, I bet. Yup. Oh, jeez. That'll do it to you. Stop. <laughs> I apologize for the crunchy Ooh. audio. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. That's a lot better. Okay. <laughs> a decision has not yet been made. But it looks like it's pretty much decided. Don't you remember what Co Judge Courtney said? This girl's Marissa. Prosecutor Edgeworth, the PIC has you in its sights. They will receive a report on everything you did here today. Uh, so we there was a long dumb case about uh, a <laughs> cooking like, competition. I don't know what you did here today. <laughs> there was a long dumb case about a cooking competition where everyone was not really a very good chef, and one of them was a murderer. <laughs> um, That's how bad he was. And <laughs> Edgeworth kept going like, "There's a murder here. I'd like to look into it." And she's like, oh, "I don't like you." And <laughs> He wouldn't leave, so she doesn't <laughs> like him. Yeah, you're and basically in trouble for doing your job. <laughs> yes. And you will most likely be required to appear before them. On trial for sucking. I... It, it sounds like it's still slowed down to me a little. Yeah. Let's... Really quick. I'm just gonna load state again, see if that fixes it. The uh, downside to this ROM is you cannot skip through dialogue. Ooh. 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 <laughs> so if we want to fix that problem by restarting, I got to do it now. <laughs> yep. Nope. That's wise. I think it's still slow. Yeah. It's still yeah, it might be in the, uh, like, Whoop. Yeah, I closed, uh -oh. I closed it because it was not running right. Uh -oh. Let's try that again. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. We gotta get this party started again. Right. This party's getting crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I love my boy Dante. I'm gonna get this me some more water. Crazy. <laughs> Devils never cry. 
<laughs> Pizza. Man. <laughs> Man. Pizza. I would I would love to watch the Devil May Cry cutscenes again. Especially three. Three is so good. One and three were a lot of fun. Two does have one great line though. Which one is that? Uh it's the the boss ass one liner where the bad guy's like, I was supposed to be a king! And Dante's like, here's your crown, and just shoots him in the head. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, my boy! Oh man. I wish DMC4 was as kooky as 3. It's just not. It's good. It's a very good game. Uh, but Joe, you yeah. might want to restart streaming for us. Oh. I didn't no, know. No, that... I don't want to see this game. I didn't know that. Oh, I wish you told me that before. I'm probably going to have to restart it again now. All right, come on. Oh, God. No. Motherfucker. <laughs> We're having a struggle. Happens. Okay, sounds good. Yeah. <laughs> Where the fuck you, Gumshoe? <laughs> what about you, bitch? Yeah, people people keep telling me this is like one of if not the best games in the series, so I'm I'm hoping it brings it for the last two cases. I don't have a lot of confidence. Yeah, it keeps chunking. Yeah, it's chunking, but I don't, I don't know, know why, why it's chunking. Animation setting. I I don't even know how to work this, so I think we're just gonna have to fucking deal with that. That's fine. Oh, we haven't seen this dialogue. Oops. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you say something like that, sir? Sorry, I was on autopilot. <laughs> the problem with the PIC is that they're false a and they're false accusations. Mr. Edgeworth, don't tell me you actually want to become a defense attorney. Fuck no. Be because you can't do that. <laughs> Getting a little <laughs> southern there. <laughs> Hang on, let me. Being a prosecutor is exciting. I gotta go get my crocodiles. <laughs> <laughs> Being a prosecutor is exactly what makes you a prosecutor, Edgeworth, sir. Wow. A defense attorney, huh? I'm not listening to Gumshoe. Let me just fade him away. I became a prosecutor because of the incident where I lost my father. However, the reason I became interested in the legal world was because my father, who passed away, had been a defense attorney. To fight crime as a prosecutor, or to save people as a defense attorney, I want you to think carefully about how you want to live your life from now on. Are you listening, sir? I don't like this one bit. No, I'm just gonna... There is no need for you to be so pessimistic. Maybe my replacement will be more lenient during your salary assessments. Ah, I see. Uh, that way I can eat more than just instant noodles every day. Oh my oh god. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, what am I saying? That's not the point here. I eat rocks, not ramen. <laughs> ramen. <laughs> ramen. He was actually imagining it. His life We're... is very hard. We're busy right now. Come back later, pal. Oh goodness. Paging this... Mr. Edgeworth, is there a Mr. Miles Edgeworth here? God, this better not be fucking uh, Maggie Bird. <laughs> Mr. Edgeworth is busy now. I'll listen to whatever you have to say later, pal. Hmm, this isn't good. Your face has become all red. Hmm, a red face, a red face, a red mole! <laughs> Stop. No! Like I said, we're kind of busy right now, so, uh... I've got it. You have a tummy ache, right? She's useless. It's definitely Maggie. This calls for an injection stat. Please roll up your sleeves. Hi! No, no, no! I'm perfectly healthy. All you eat is instant ramen. That is not true. <laughs> <laughs> Who might you your be? Your veins are noodles. Ah, oh, I'm so sorry. I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Karen Jensen. What is that? What is that? Caring. Caring, I don't know. 
Karen Jensen, maybe injection? Hmm. Karen Jensen? I'm some? a registered nurse at the Dai Young Hospital. Oh, what? no. Wow. <laughs> I'm sorry, but no such hospital exists. <laughs> I'm sorry, but nobody here is sick. You must have the wrong room. Are you Mr. Miles Sedgworth? You have such great wrinkles between your brow. Thank you, I just got those installed. <laughs> Could it be lupus? What the fuck? <laughs> it's always oh, lupus. For an injection. It, it's not lupus. Just tell me what business you have with me. Ah, yes, yes. Actually, there's someone who would like to see you. Please wait a moment. I'll call them in here right now. Wait! Hey, get your ass in here! Oh, it's just Gumshoe. <laughs> <laughs> they made a second one of me, sir. She left, sir. I wonder who she's gonna bring. Hmm, she's bringing someone from the hospital. Could it be a patient, sir? It's Kay in a full body cast. <laughs> 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 maybe it's someone. <laughs> maybe it's someone who's traumatized by harsh words. What is that supposed to mean? See, when you glare at me like that, it feels like I'm gonna have the heart attack. Send someone to the hospital with that. Is it really that bad? I'm just being my normal self, though. He's got resting bitch face. I understand, boo. <laughs> Aww. Uh, oh. Do you? I guess since Kay is also here, do you want to tag in for this girl, Marissa? Sure. Oh, this girl. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, K, like, K the is the one? girl I think that just got brought oh, in. Oh, okay. Sorry for the wait. Well, what do you think? Oh my god. Jesus. Oh, honey. What do I think? I'll go. <laughs> it is. Um, do you not recognize me? Now that she mentions it, I feel like I've met her before. Hmm, no. Um, this card, your name was written on it. Oh, does she have fucking memory loss? Oh, yeah, it's, oh. it's an anime. Oh. <clears throat> oh, no. Do you know now that my am? character has been deleted, we can write a good one instead. <laughs> oh, thank God. Miss Edgeworth, maybe you really did send her to the hospital. Of course not. <laughs> but this is your business card, sir. You <laughs> always leave these on the people you kill. <laughs> that means <laughs> he's says, the murderer. <laughs> it clearly says prosecutor Miles Edgeworth. Um, I did it. That's true. But he's a defense attorney now, so irrelevant. <laughs> yeah. She I am crying. terribly sorry. I'm, uh, well. The truth is, this girl suffers from memory loss. M memory loss? You've seen it coming. <laughs> you see, when Kay hit the ground from that skyscraper, she split into two people me and this girl. <laughs> Shut <laughs> up! <laughs> Yes, that seems to be the case. Uh, her parents should be worried sick right now. <laughs> Why are you bad news for you? <laughs> they probably haven't been able to sleep. I doubt they've gotten more than eight hours. Isn't that plenty of sleep? Well, I mean, I guess. <laughs> Jesus. I see. It sure sounds horrible, but it's all right now. Do you guys have fucking memory loss? The hell is wrong with you? <laughs> it's gonna be fine. The first half of this case is figuring out who this girl could possibly be. <laughs> we Since should call Kate. That... I shouldn't make jokes. Since she has that business card, she must be an acquaintance of Mr. Edgeworth. It's certainly heading that way. Just leave it, leave her to us, pal. Right, Mr. Edgeworth? Oh yeah. Indeed, we might be able to verify her identity at least. Would you really do that for me? First, I'd like you to tell us everything that you know. That's all, Mr. Edgeworth. You have nothing to worry about now, miss. That's all, Mr. Edgeworth, saying words at a human. <laughs> <laughs> he was got programmed it, it. for it. I wasn't built for it. I was just built to eat rocks. I was built for excavating with my mouth and tummy. <laughs> <laughs> but still, where to begin? What should I ask her first? Miss, do you remember your name? My name? Oh, I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> I love how they I use can only the remember the... Sorry. You're terribly <laughs> sorry. <laughs> there you go. Sorry. I, I can only remember the first letter, K. I don't know anymore, though. <laughs> sorry, don't know anyone with that name. Wait, 
Wait a minute, are you Callisto, you? <laughs> She's been like this ever since yesterday, you know? Hmm. So you found her yesterday? Wow, that's amazing! How'd you know? I... Oh boy. What? <laughs> what a tiresome Gary, woman. you're a real bright bulb. <laughs> I found her stumbling around late last night, so I took her in. You see, I found her right outside the Spirit Halloween store after I bought this costume. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to help her out, so I looked through her things. What? <laughs> so, that's how you found my business card. Did she have anything else with her? Just about $200 in cash, but... But don't I don't know that. where those went. <laughs> 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 Nothing to reveal her name or address, oh, but... She was wearing this when I found her. It's an unusual design, don't you think? What? This badge is... What? She's a Pokemon trainer! <laughs> the the Garasus! That mean it couldn't be! <laughs> oh man, my Tiramisu has been one up! <laughs> Yadagarasu! Otherwise known as Tira Tiramisu 2. <laughs> Man, Sammy, you are fucking wobbling on this American accent wire today. Yeah, right? I am today. It's really fucking going back and forth in it. I ain't in it. <laughs> are you okay? Hey. No, I'm not okay. I'm having problems. I have brain damage, Mr. Edgeworth. Uh, I have so many jokes I could make, but they're only they're Bomberman Jenner references, so no one. Oh would my get god! Them. <laughs> There's an arc like this. You are K, right? I am K. K. Don't you remember? She has memory loss, dude. I mean, you know always call me Gummy Pal. Gummy. Man, her sprites are so much better in this mode. They sure are. I would call one of my elders something so rude? Huh, I'm so sorry. What a horrible thing I did. I feel like my heart is going to burst from guilt. Calm down. Just, just what happened to you, pal? You've become so sensitive. If you're this sensitive and delicate and frail, well, you can never not commit like crimes. me, a big dumb rock golem. Then you're not even K anymore. You're someone else, pal. Whoa! Watch your words, detective. Oh, <laughs> pardon him. He's a dumb rock monster. If you say that, <laughs> it almost sounds like K isn't sensitive or del. What? It almost sounds like K isn't sensitive or delicate at all. Though None I can't of these deny that she. To, say to someone <laughs> who has memory loss. <laughs> Though I can't deny there is some truth to what he says. K's the worst. <laughs> What sort of awful, terrible person was I before I lost my memory? Well, you always said you were a thief, but you didn't actually ever steal a single thing. I don't know, you were just an Ace would Attorney I steal anime things? girl. Why would I lie? Well, for starters, your name was Kay Faraday. I forgot that was your fucking surname, jeez. A cheerful girl <laughs> full of spirit and vigor, and a great thief. Great thief? I mean, you were all right. Yes, to put it frankly, a great thief- You were Kay. <laughs> <laughs> a great thief steals valuables from people's drawers and safes. Steal? I caused so much trouble for others! Oh, I'm so sorry! I never imagined I would be a criminal! Maybe my losing. <laughs> no, she's babbling incoherently! <laughs> <laughs> no, you didn't actually. Listen, you, it's fine. You never stole anything. It was just a dumb, facetious gimmick. Uh, uh, this is so <laughs> much help, sir. <laughs> He's a thwomp. But it does sort of make sense, you know? <laughs> <laughs> These gloves and stuff, they look just like what a thief might wear. I brought her clothing to. <laughs> That or ninja? It's, it's you not turned her invisible! Those <laughs> clothes! Yes, she was wearing them when I found her. I, I had her that. change her clothes, so I'm holding on to them for now. Yeah, oh. Just in case! <laughs> Something appears to be stuck on her clothes. What's all it's this a red bullet. liquid? A bullet? <laughs> she was pushed off the cliff by a bullet! <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps it has Just something. A bullet with big Mickey Mouse gloves to yes, shove it. Yes, 
Your time's up, see? <laughs> Perhaps it has something to do with Kay's memory loss. I'll send it down to the lab later and have him check it out, sir. Good. I will be counting on you, Detective Gumshoe. At any rate, these really look like a thief's clothes, don't they? Stop. Stop. I'm sure they'll be worth a lot at the pawn shop. <laughs> I'm a criminal. <laughs> it's true, you were a thief, but never once did you commit a crime. <laughs> that alone, I can assure you. God, you were just a fucking embarrassment, frankly. <laughs> Is that so? <laughs> it's probably better if I don't press this issue any further. Goodbye. Get out of my house. <laughs> I'm really sorry for not remembering you. Um, what kind of relationship did we have? You would just break into my office and tag along on terrible adventures. <sighs> it's rather difficult to explain. Kay, you were... Mr. Edgeworth's assistant! Oh my! So then a prosecutor is the kingpin of a great thief? That would be a much oh. more interesting game, sorry. <laughs> no, that's not what I meant, pal. The last time I met Kay was the day before yesterday. Just what did she do from then up until now? Miss Jensen, was the badge the only thing this girl had on her? She did have some other things, but I don't think they'll be very helpful at all. What's don't that sticking out of your them. pocket? It looks like Nothing. a bunch of money. Uh, it's mine. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard of this. I don't mind. Please, show them to me. Well, well then, I'll give them to you one by one, okay? I just need to make it rain on Edgeworth. <laughs> Single dollar bills. Single dollar bills to distract him with one dollar at a time, and she's like, oh, that's worth something. <gasps> Throws it out the window towards her car. <laughs> this is a this is a gem and mint ninja man. <laughs> Maybe she went to a superhero show or something. Hmm. This seems to be a letter addressed to Kay. Well, I'm not going to read it. This is a ticket stop, <laughs> and this is... A flower made of cloth. Like the ones you usually see in... I, I guess... No, hold on. Like the ones you usually see in restrooms, sir, not just you. That is... That is the first thing I think of when I think of cloth flowers. Cloth flowers. <laughs> a corsage. It's used primarily as an accessory for women. Well, that's everything. Did you find anything out? Um, not really. <laughs> a bunch of random things. I'll have to look them over in more detail later. Unfortunately, I'm almost out of batteries, so it's time to rest. <laughs> and I'm almost out of rock power. I keep this pipe's getting crazy. He thinks, Let's rock. He thinks rock power is a thing. It's not. <laughs> I hope someone shows up soon that will can voice. I'm f I'm I'm fine just chilling here. <laughs> I mean maybe Ray oh, will show this up is... and you can pass off gumshoe. Yeah, if, if Ray does show up, I'll pass off gumshoe yeah. to you. Sure. Oh this is horrible! Case lost the memory! How do we get it back to normal? Calm down, detective. I have already thought of something. Hit her with one of your big rocks! <laughs> Oh, as I would expect of Mr. Edgeworth. So what did he find out, sir? Look at this ticket stub. Oh, it's a ticket for the viewing platform of the Grand Tower. Oh, you're still here. <laughs> yeah, apparently. <laughs> um, Ms. Nurse, do you know something about the Grand Tower? It's tall. <laughs> <laughs> of course it has I a do. clock. It's a super famous dating spot after all. They say that if a couple holds hands up there, they'll be together forever. <laughs> <laughs> the timestamp on the ticket is from yesterday. Moreover, it's only valid on the day of issue. Oh, since she only has the stub, then she must have used it, right? Very good, Gumshoe. It is very likely. Well then, let's go. Uh, right now, sir? Yes, I thought the two of us might go on a, um, go on a date. Could be fun. Can the kind of golem and an android find love in this world? <laughs> Do you think love can bloom even on the cloth battlefield? It's the, <laughs> the cause of Kay's memory loss is hidden in her actions. But, but what about the PIC? It's still too early for me to be summoned there. Um, 
So should should I leave Kay with you then? She shouldn't go back to the hospital, clearly. That is what I would prefer. Kay, you're fine with that, right? I can't walk. <laughs> yeah, all right, come on. <laughs> Don't you drag her. Well, I have to get back to work, so if anything happens, please contact the Die Young Hospital. We'll just leave this random woman in this random man's care. It's fine. If you guys need an injection, I'll be there anytime, any place. What kind of injection? Yes, <laughs> I understand. I don't think I will call her for an injection, though. All right, well, bye. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> For some reason, I just picture her walking straight into the closed door over and over again. Let me just, just make it. Get my the boom, but the, but the boom. There's some kind of force field here. <laughs> well then, let's go, detective. And you too, Kay. Oof. Yes, sir. Strong. Thank you for helping me. Don't thank uh, me yet. Uh, mm. I need shoes. 